Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be sharing a presentation regarding commercial methods of food preservation by use of low temperatures. Foods are stored at low temperatures to prevent the growth of microorganisms, activity of enzymes, and chemical reactions. Freezing prevents the growth of microorganisms and also inhibits the chemical reactions and activity of enzymes. Refrigeration below 5 degrees centigrade retards the growth of foodborne pathogens. The cooling rate is important in controlling the growth of microorganisms. A slow cooling of food allows time to microbial growth. So first, let's talk about cellar storage. A root cellar is a structure, usually underground or partially underground, used for storage of vegetables, fruits, nuts or other foods. Mostly, root crops like potatoes and carrots are stored in an underground cellar. Although a wide variety of foods can potentially be stored for weeks to months, depending on the crop and the conditions, and the structure may not always be underground. Root cellars are for keeping food supplies at controlled temperatures and steady humidity. Optimal temperature and humidity ranges vary crop by crop. Root cellars keep food from freezing during the winter and keep food cool during the summer to prevent spoilage. It is also a place to store wine, beer or other homemade alcoholic beverages. Vegetables stored in the root cellar primarily consist of potatoes, turnips and carrots. Other foods include beets, onions, charred preserves and jams, salt meat, salt turbot, salt herring, winter squash, and cabbage. Refrigeration or chill storage A refrigerator is one of the most important pieces of equipment in the kitchen for keeping foods safe. Importance of refrigeration Refrigeration slows bacterial growth. Bacteria exist everywhere and when they have nutrients from food, moisture, and favorable temperatures, they grow rapidly increasing in numbers to the point where some types of bacteria can cause illness. A refrigerator set at 40 degree Fahrenheit or below will protect most of the foods. Safe handling of foods for refrigerating. Hot foods can be placed directly in the refrigerator or it can be rapidly chilled in ice or cold water bath before refrigerating. The foods should be covered to retain moisture and prevent them from picking up odors from other foods. A large pot of food like soup or stew should be divided into small portions and put in shallow containers before being refrigerated. A large cut of meat or whole poultry should be divided into smaller pieces or placed in shallow containers before refrigerating. Controlled or modified atmosphere storage Controlled atmosphere storage refers to a continuously controlled gas atmosphere, while modified atmosphere storage refers to a gas composition that is initially modified. The gas composition within a modified atmosphere storage will change over time due to the respiration rate of food products and the permeability of the packaging surrounding the food products. Benefits of Controlled Atmospheric Storage The primary benefit of lowering oxygen and increasing carbon dioxide surrounding the produce lowers the respiration or metabolic rate of the commodity, leading to slowing down of the natural senescence process. Careful attention must be taken to maintain a good control on the precise levels of modified gases since too high levels of carbon dioxide or oxygen will likely injure fruits and vegetables. Increasing commercial use of this technology over recent years in both the short and long term has always been in response to market demand for the supply of all types of fresh fruits and vegetables. Freezing Freezing preservation is one of the most beneficial preservation method which involves Conversion of liquid content of food into ice crystals, which lowers down water activity and microbial growth is arrested due to cold shock. Pure water is frozen at 0 degrees centigrade 
but since fruits and vegetables contain a number of dissolved solids like sugars acids they freeze at below 0 degree centigrade the primary goal of freezing is to prevent growth of microorganisms by killing some bacteria reducing water activity mechanical formation of ice crystals osmotic changes in cell fluids and tying up some water next is to lower temperature enough to slow down chemical reactions every 10 degree centigrade decrease in temperature halves the reaction rate quick freezing quick freezing is the process of rapidly freezing products in fast freezing small ice crystals form and good quality is maintained a quick frozen food is cooled from a temperature of 0 degree centigrade to minus 5 degree centigrade or lower in a period of not more than 2 hours and then cooled to minus 18 degree centigrade slow freezing slow freezing is probably the most commonly used freezing process worldwide when meat is frozen slowly large ice crystals form that break the fibers and cells upon defrosting these meats lose more juice this is called drip loss and the texture is not good although the meat loses quality it is safe to eat thank you so much guys for watching this video i hope you like it